In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the ConnectSoft JSON OPC server to connect to the Bureau of Meteorology data that's provided by Australia in order to pull real-time weather data from their, their web service. So we start by launching the system management console that installs with the server. If we then open this up and open the configuration, you can see that I've licensed the software here. And once we've done that, we can add a JSON service object. So I right clicked, we add the JSON service object, I'll call this weather data, and I will add the URL for the JSON web service. This checkbox here tells the server to browse the namespace that, that the web service provides and import in all the tags or pieces of data as OPC items so that they can be made available to OPC clients. If I then save this, um, I can then deactivate the service and activate it again. And once I've done this, this will cause the tags to get imported. Okay. Uh, the next thing we need to do is connect an OPC client. So I have a sample client here. We can add a connection to the JSON OPC server. We're going to add a group. And then now we can browse the namespace to look at all the tags. If we look under the weather data, we see some system tags here. But if we scroll down a little further, we will see that this exposes the data in an array format where data zero is the first element in the array, and then it goes down through all the elements in the array. So I'm going to add just data zero to my client here. Click add leaves, click OK. And once we query the web service, you'll see that the quality changes to good. And we have actual data that represents the air temperature, uh, the wind gust speed, and latitude, local time, and so on and so forth. You can see all the data that's made available in, in, this, uh, in this array here. Now, this was done with a sample client, but any OPC client can connect to this JSON OPC server and read this real-time weather data. 